Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. We're jumping in and testing out Junk Survivor. This game is available on Steam as of the 27th of April. If you want to check it out for yourself, there's a link in the description down below. And yes, the developer actually sent out a whole bunch of keys. So if you jump into the Discord, there's links down there in the description, just down here. And if you guys want to jump in and of course, be there for it. We're going to give away the keys this week. I think it's like 25 keys, something like that. So yeah, very, very cool. Thanks to the dev for making that possible. Thank you, of course, for all being here. If you're enjoying us, please take time at like button. If you're brand new, please don't subscribe. What is Junk Survivor Game Edge? Junk Survivor is a zombie post-apocalyptic game, of course, where you loot, craft, build, and farm to struggle to survive. So this is what we're gonna do. There's a vast map to explore. And even here it says, explore vast map that keeps on growing. So we seeing all the loot and all that stuff it looked really cool again thanks to dev for making this possible let's jump in and see what it's all about well look at this it looks like we actually have some skill points we can put out we have two of them available currently affect the base damage and carry weight of your character i'm going to want carry weight always so i will take one of those and agility affects the critical damage and base armor hmm affects the stock of maximum health uh, okay i'm gonna take that and what is this? Uh, affects the base damage of ore veins and trees and gathering resources. Oh, we want that. Affects the chance of critical damage. All right, well, I'm going to stick with strength in this. Honestly, I, carrying is always a big problem. Uh, base damage. <sighs> Getting ores and stuff would be handy, but oh, God darn it. We're going to go with double on those. Uh, just again it's always about the carrying weight for me and, and most of the survival games less than learn that uh the second one would be this one of course and stamina is another one here day one we've arrived and kick in and yeah developer mentioned there'll be tutorials i think later on currently there is no tutorials available so yeah we kind of yeah, if you play survival games you'll be fine i'm sure uh these are all our stats right here and if you open this up here uh, which is something else the dev was saying go and check those out something that people are forgetting to look at and here we go character level is one available skill point is zero and there is actually uh right now the fencer which you can give additional damage and when melee and you can see a whole bunch of these things increasing health that's pretty good too sharp pursuiter ammo smith gunsmith and medic and of course our armor here i think right all right, the thing is, uh, I just realized, yep, yep, can't press escape to go back out of this, so that is something. All right, well, hopefully they can change that. I don't know what it is, but escape is like our go-to key. Uh, when we're loading in, they did give a little bit of tutorials about uh, being able to hit trees, just like Ark and other things here. So we're going to smack this baby up. We also seem to be getting something else with that. Currently, we're getting fiber. We can carry up to 320 pounds. That's pretty nice. The game doesn't look bad at all. I don't know what to say. I mean, it's, it looks good for this early. I mean, this is not a finished product. Again, it's coming out the 27th of April. So, I mean, we have multiple updates, I'm sure, afterwards and stuff. And again, yeah, go and check it out. Really cool. Come join on Discord, too. That chance to get a free key. Why not, right? That's really awesome. Am I actually really putting some serious damage on this tree? Uh, 27.15. Okay, let's just start with that. Let's see if we can craft up off the go here. We need wood and cloth. Uh, cloth most likely made with fiber right so let's craft up that you get five cloth or no one cloth okay five fiber takes one cloth right let's just uh do whatever we possibly can we're obviously gonna need more fiber hopefully we can pick some up maybe those bushes up there uh we'll get ourselves a stone hatchet to craft up right off the fly we need five of those okay they see a tab it's gonna be an issue i knew that for a fact uh let's see here 29 yeah let's go see if we can find fiber fiber if those things here are fiber is a possibility everything's very green can I not smack these yeah okay so only way to get fiber right now that i can see is for us to smack these babies up here so we're just gonna grab a little more like i said we haven't even gone farther than this so there's some stuff on our table too maybe it's just press e no damn it <laughs> i need five to get one hatchet here Okay, and let's see here. Back up to crafting five cloth. How many can I do? That was making sense. I'm sure. I'm sure. What? I what? Oh, I need 85. Okay, I was like, wait a second. <laughs> My bad. Craft that all up. This way we can now make ourselves a stone here. We can also make ourselves maybe 30 wood and 10 cloth. Uh, that I could hit trees with my fist. Maybe I'll work on the cloth to get the pickaxe. I'm pretty sure we won't be able to smack up those things with this. So we'll see 
what's what. Is there any weapons I could craft up on a fly, though? Because it would be really nice. We got ourselves these, including wood mallet for building. We can make ourselves a wooden club, eight wood. That's really nice. Let's craft that up. And I'll actually craft up a torch in case. I don't like being stuck with that one, just in case something happens here. It gets really dark. I'm not sure how the game will react in the future at nighttime, so we'll see. All right, is that done? That's perfect. No spear currently. It's too bad. Uh, there's more workbenches, bed rolls, mortar, simple chest, wood uh, doors, of course, simple door locks. Okay, that's nice. This is all nice stuff. Uh, I guess building plans with 30 fiber. Yeah, I, I really... Oh, God, escape. Ugh. It's going to be something I'll have to get used to. Tab it out. Okay, so take all. Okay. I'll get used to it. So many different games out there. We're getting water and foods and they're stacking nicely. Something that irritates me when you don't. Oh, we found some cloth and a fly, I think. Is that paper? Ah, oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> oh, we did find cloth. I was I was one ahead. We found cloth on the fly. Uh looks like we have our first body here. I'm not sure if that's what they want to kind of do, is just mess around. See. God, he looks scary a bit. Find a green, a little green, but I mean, who knows what kind of happened in the environment and stuff. I see pretty good takedown there. I'm liking that. I uh, got ourselves for first stone. I know I did take all afterwards, so I just feel like doing it. Okay, and then if I don't want anything in my hands. Am I going to get more fiber from a smaller tree than I would get wood? Which would make more sense, right? Oh. Yeah, I think I'm getting way more fiber. So hit up the smaller trees if you want to go that direction. You want to carry too much stuff of wood. Looks like some cinder blocks there on the right-hand side. I'm sure we can grab the tarp and stuff too. That'd be pretty sweet. All right. How much do I have now? 38. Man, I got like 60 wood, man. It's freaking awesome. We're, we're definitely rocking this really early on. <laughs> Reminds me of some days night when you first start. You got to knock out everything. Get yourself kind of going. Every survival game. But this one has a little bit of familiar start to this one okay let's get that cloth going i'm gonna need uh again 10 cloths for this one i also need to make myself one of these and 10 cloth and 30 so i need 40 cloth let's see if we can make how much we can make we have 61 let's craft those up we're gonna get 12 more so like i said maybe uh the axe would be a good idea to go to oh it does destroy oh i see i was curious so they do break after a certain amount of time I wonder if they come back, though. That's a good question, isn't it? All right, let's take this. We'll put this in our building area. How does the torch look, by the way? That's automatic light. Perfect. Like that. Maybe I should make the axe. Maybe I'll just get more in one bang. Also, I have to sit here and hit things up like 60 million times. I'm going to go with it. It seems logical. Then we'll get a little more bang front. Let's just get walking and see a little more of the game, too. We got some cinder blocks. Got a nice little chain link fence here. Bar bar on top. Looks like a town ahead of us. Do we have a map? We do not currently have a map. Okay. You know what? I, I, I got to tell you, it, it looks pretty nice. Very green. But it's fine. All right, we'll get the axe here. Let's see what this does. Will it give me... It'll give me everything faster for sure, right? And it does have durability too, which is great. I have 20. Let's just see here. I'm not getting any fiber from this, right? No, give me wood a lot faster. So I don't know how to get the pickaxe done a little faster than that, though. I guess if we loot up a little bit more, we should be okay. We are carrying 8.2 of 320. That is pretty impressive. I'm not going to lie to you. It would also be nice is that if you click and hold, since it's going to be a little bit of spamming at the beginning. I know some people have that problem, too. They can't hold and click and stuff but it's it's definitely a lot nicer than to go uh full out clicks on something but you know it's all good all right how much cloth do we have now 72 of those plant fibers we're doing pretty good i'm talking i'm not even concentrating i need to get 30 of these plant fibers to make this building thing and we need 15 of those and then i still need 10 so 25 of those would be nice and we're probably not there yet but we're, we'll craft all right, let's go into town a bit. I, I want to just be hitting up things constantly. We'll take out our club. By the way, the durability in a club dropped heavily. Can we repair those? Not that I see right now, so maybe a good idea to have a deuce of clubs here. Just in case of emergency, until we find something else. 
Yeah, I think I'm going to craft that up. I don't think we can repair. Maybe in a workbench? I'm not sure. We have spoiled meat right off the bat. How much does it give me back here total? 10, 10 hunger. Let's just see this. Okay, that's pretty good. We'll, uh, we'll spoil a little bit. Sounds like a plan. An empty bottle and a full bottle. Okay, that's going to happen again. Pretty good. All right, we'll make that happen. Oof, perfect. And then slide this over and have our bat here in case something else happens. Oh, is this bush breakable? Well, no. It's pretty solid. I'm not seeing any damage to it. Went to my... No. All right, I was hoping we get some fiber. Oh, boy. All right. Look, we got Zombros right there and Zombros here. Can we open this door now? <laughs> Probably look at these brains. I love it. Give me those brains. All right, what else do we have here? Take all. All right, so I increased the uh, sound a little bit. I find it's a little bit quiet, but when we're indoors, it seems a little more quiet. We're getting some okay stuff. We're getting paper, uh, some fiber and stuff. All right, we're getting, like, even cloth. I can see all those ombros even inside the house over there. I'm going to want to craft up uh, the billing plans. What One. Did I do two? It's impossible to do two, right? Don't do two. 30 plant fiber. Oh, it's fiber. Oh, no. I got a lot of cloth now. By the way, I didn't really look at that. I automatically had it in my head. My stupidities. We've got paint. Vehicle paint blue. There's cars. Like you're not. We already did this. I wasn't sure. Can I drag one of you at a time? Oh, I didn't even check the seat. Can we make bandages? That's one thing I did not make. That was pretty stupid of me. Fuel buildings, equipment. 30 cloth and a leather. Ouch. Metal ingots, clay, cloth, yeah. Do we not have health kits? Do we can craft here? I guess not right now. Maybe not crafting bench is possible, I guess. I didn't see medical stuff either kind of drop from any of these like areas here. If I can drag one of you. No one I said, Jesus, not a party. <clears throat> yeah, they're pretty fast, dudes. I leveled up. I had a bush behind me. Okay. Oh, they, they have a little bit of an issue about leaving here. Ha ha! That was your weakness. You don't want to leave your mommy. It's all good, dude. The citizen does not want to leave the building. The oh, shit. No, no. Okay. You found my... my oh. <laughs> you found out I can get screwed, too. I loot you guys. All right. It's all good. I looted, I actually, well, I boosted up here, so that's pretty nice. And we're going to have to make ourselves something and find somewhere to make ourselves something. All right, well, we, at least we got rid of that. We're also getting some f uh, monies. I see monies get thrown in somewhere? Where's my money? I think it just goes into a back or maybe over here. Energy, skills, maximum health. Uh, we actually have an available skill point currently. I think I'm going to grab... All right, so I took intelligence as skill set. It's gone dark. Can you swim with this? Okay, good. Sounds sounds healthy. I think somebody may need some uh, attention. Do we need attention? Got some cans. I guess we're gonna smelt those down too. Oh shit! Shit! Didn't realize. You oh my god! There's three of you. Okay, I know I know how to get out of here. I might actually go and build my base where we first started. It seems like the most logical place to go. Okay, these guys won't go out here, right? I'm not sure if they can or they, they roam at night. I don't see any water source either around here. Uh-huh. Okay, are we safe? We are somewhat safe. 
Okay, this is giving back health too. By the way, hunger. 10 EP. Raw steak. I think I'm just going to craft something out right now. Bedroll. 12 wood and 5 cloth. Let's craft that. I need room soon. Do I have enough uh, food on me? 10, what does this give you? 5 each. Okay, let's just swap this out right now and eat. Oh boy, it just got super dark. I'll fill up our bellies. Moves back in here. And actually, we'll get the bed rolled down. Can I put this anywhere? Am I too close to town? Oh, I can't see anything. Does this need to be... Place building object. This definitely sounds like it needs to be on a... Oh, no. Yeah. I don't think I can place this down without building something. That's not cool. All right. Uh, where's the smaller stuff here? I need to get my hands. I need to get building plants, so let me smack this up a little bit. Yeah, I'm, it's a tree that's taking damage, not me, which I'm looking to my health. It seems to be perfectly fine. Well, we'll need to build somewhere near water. And it's impossible to see right now, so we're just probably going to make ourselves one little frame. Just to say we've done it. Do we have 30 of these? We do. Okay, craft this up. Not that I got the right thing. Okay. Boom. Alright. So three... Place building, rotate shift, manage building height, press right to open the building menu. I gotcha. All right, let's get this one uh, little foundation so we can get some sleep. Let's not invest too much just yet. Is that built? I can't even tell, dude. It's so freaking dark. I think I made a torch, but I need to hold on to stuff to make this happen. So hold on. Okay. Okay, game edge. How do I sleep? 3,000. Can we... It says attack. Okay, let's open my torch for a second. It says destroy. How do you sleep? Do you not sleep at all? You can't, I guess? That may be very possible, too, dudes. Oh, God. Literally, it destroys it. Like, gone. Alright, I hope they change that. That's... <laughs> Oh, it's okay. 150 wood, 5 leather. We're far away from that. So bedroll, in theory, should be able to be rolled up and taken with you, right? That's how things usually work with these. Quick little bedrolls, and I don't see it popping back. I'm like taking a quick look here. It looks like it just completely destroys it no matter what. All right. Now we got our first foundation down. I think finding water is imperative. Not sure how big this map is currently on its launch day. But water sources or even like a well would be nice to find. It's a big town though. Got a lot of little uh little uh, houses for us to go visit. This is spooky as frig though at night. So I don't have to worry about fatigue, I guess. This is what they're saying. What does it say here? I don't know what the top one is. It says 10. 10 stars. That's when you find out there's a bear game edge. Yeah, this is actually a very big freak. There's a lot of POIs in here. I see the street lamps and stuff. They're not working. Street lights are, I should say. There's vehicles right there, too. I guess the only way for us to do it is just, you know what, rock it and explore this. Even if it's at nighttime. Can I make a chest? Make a chest here. Yeah, storage chest 40 and 5. <laughs> what the frick? What? Did I get any nails? Did, not, did my torch just break, really? Alright. That's a little fast for me, but it's okay. Torch. And you know what? I'm just I'm just speaking out just to make sure that, you know, as I'm talking through this. It's not despite them as when it releases a game itself. These are the kind of things that are going to be coming up for sure. Torches are not long enough. Uh, make a chest, at least something I could store stuff in early on. 
I mean, do I need to carry everything I just carried? No. That's for sure. Like, painted stuff. I've seen you before. I've seen you. Some taxis and stuff there. Chair. Are all the houses haunted or... Well, haunted. Full of Zobros and Zombinos. Not this one. So if I have a bedroll, can I place it in here and sleep? I mean, maybe that's what it is. Not covered. Sometimes it's not covered is a big thing. I guess I could put a barrier in front of that, right? If I want to. No, it really needs to be in your own base. Okay. That makes it a little more difficult. Is there water nearby? There's a street going through here. Like, again, no map right off the bat. It's tough. Usually the biggest pain is to find some POIs. Now, it looks like there's a water tower over there. So possible some agua. I mean, I can't... I'm going to try to fight with this torch if I need to. They don't seem to be uberly dis like disturbed by me walking by. Maybe I smell that bad. There's like a group of them right there near the water tower. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, maybe possibly maybe more than that. I just want to know if the water tower is something we can there's some of the freaking cornfields too. Yeah, that, that's not a scarecrow. I just want to see if I can grab that water or not. Okay. Well only one way to find out, right? Yeah, it looks like there's a ladder, but I can't seem to make it a go on that one. Are they attacking me at all? No. They're like sleepy zombies at night. That's pretty amazing. I like that. Yeah, I'm not seeing like water sources anywhere whatsoever. So I'm just... Are we just supposed to loot and get water at the beginning? Maybe that's what it is. There's something huge on the other side of that thing. I'm, what the frick is that? Guys see it? I don't know if you can see it in this darkness. What the frick is that? It's like a big bowl or something. I have no idea. Oh, it's a propane tank, I think. Uh, it's gas, yeah. Oh, more Zombros. All right, let's see if we can just put up something here and we can work our way around where we're like close to two towns anyways for now. Looks like there's another cars or stuff back there. I have no idea where we're supposed to uh, sleep or anything, so this is going to be something. Let's just go. It doesn't look like it's uh, going to be easy. Maybe I'm a little too close. That is a possibility that... Oh, no, there's a wall here, isn't there? Ah, that's a wall. So that's probably why they're saying it's ever grow oh, growing. Looks like it might be growing a little bit more. The map is constantly being expanded. I might just be on the edge of it. That's it. Great. Can I not afford more? Is that it? The amount of wood? All right, it's not a problem. I got actually an axe, so this should be like a fudge ton easier. Get a little bit of fiber. Why not? At the same time. Got to make another bed anyway. Oh, I sure have one. Oh, level up. All right, we'll take that. Let's go and check this. Do we have points here too? Available skill points? Yeah. So you have available skill points here or on here. Increase of melee damage. Learn how to craft badges. Okay, well, that's just logical there. And, uh, a workbench. Learn how to craft a... Okay, bandaid. I think I need two points for each one. Is that it? Start off with? Oh, no. Oh, Crap, can I take it out? Does that open up other ones as you go through? Because this was highlighted. Okay. Well, you know, I'll take it. Whatever. It's all good. It's all good. Uh, can we get rid of these uh, stumps? It looks like there's a possibility. I'm not getting any wood from it. But I got a little bit. There we go. Nine at the end of it. So we still get some fiber. Not as much. 
Holy crap, dude. That scared the bejesus out of me. Thank you. So the knights are not excruciating along. I'd like to find some nails if I could. Alright, and... Just get up a quick door. Again, the arrow's pointing one direction, please. Unless they're both the same, right? That's what it is. You don't know. Am I out? I'm out. Okay, so we obviously need a whole bunch more work to be done there. We can put this here. I need to find nails ASAP. Before anything else. Also, be nice if we could pick this up, you know? Also, just destroy it. So we're going to do... Oh, my God. It's a freaking camp over here. Tell me that's not where I'm supposed to go. I come in peace. Well, there's traitors and stuff in here, I think. Yep. That's funny. All right, Jeb. Books, okay, chairs. Oh, you have to learn through here. Holy moly. All right, dude. Keep on rocking. Your twin brother? Man, it's all a bunch of vehicle parts. That is sweet. All right. Can I use this fire? Oh, I can use it without having to make our own. Turn on. Let's throw the meat that we have. Let's not let it go to waste. I must be hungry in the morning. Yeah. Canned food seems to stay forever, so I'm not going to worry about that. The only thing is I have one water bottle left. I don't know where this meat's from. I think there's a possibility I picked this out of the trash. Does it give me a can? It doesn't give me the can when I'm eating out of this. That's too bad. And water. So yeah, water source, water source, water source. You guys not drinking here at all? What's this? Ash. Interesting. All right. Is that water in here, dude? Water catcher. Well, that's pretty sweet. I turn it on. Yeah, make that water, dude. Oh, yeah. All right. Now we're talking. So, wait a second. I can use this place as my main base as I'm building back out. I actually want to be closer to these dudes. Got a water catcher right here to start off with so we can survive. I'm liking that. It does take a fudge long time to make this water, which is, you know, it is water after all. But any cost you would if you want to get more. Just for one friggin' water. Holy moly. We'll go ahead up the other town. I mean, trees are everywhere. I can knock down a whole bunch of trees for this stuff, so I'm not too worried about it. Where's my other uh, bottle? Did it just disappear? Am I dropping stuff when I'm drinking and eating? Why don't I get the bottle back? You can reuse that several times. Correct? I don't know why that would be something. But it was. Alright, well, we got campfire. Does he have a forge here, too, or what? Is that a bench? He's just happy to see me. Oh, it's no stall. And, of course, stalls there. Okay. Oh, I can take a shower. That's pretty fun. Can't actually do it, but it looks like can. All right, let's go and check out the town really quick and see if we can find just a little more stuff. We got ourselves a little bit of a base started. It's not far away. We actually being close like this, not so bad. Can make ourselves across something across the road here. Yeah, that's that's, that's quite a few little zombros. Maybe they'll have nails inside a gas station. Why would they do that? I don't know. I was I'm just thinking. It's not a hardware store, but it still would be nice if we could find some. Yeah, okay, I have to find out where that money is going. Scare me a little bit. There's some monies and fuel. Oh, 
I understand. Is it a coin? Okay, where did it go now? Did it go into my inventory somewhere? Okay. <laughs> I love it. Hey, dude. Look like half Frankenstein, half zombie. Don't you? Okay, you didn't appreciate that. Oh, too bad. All right, what do we have here? Some dirt. Okay, let's see. What's the thing about a farmer or something? Guy was tending that field. Which is kind of interesting. It's actually went there. You know, the field when I got him. The real deal. Come for a test drive. Come for a test drive with multiple zombies outside. Dude, I don't like when POIs are empty. No, it's not horrible at all. I mean, I'll be honest with you. I'm kind of surprised. I, I, I came in here thinking much different. And I'm pleasantly surprised. And thanks for Death for giving us keys, too, so you guys can experience it if you want to pick it up for yourself. I believe it's also multiplayer, right? I think we saw the start. Okay. Yeah, we got some more danger in there. The bat does last a lot longer. That's pretty good. I'm throwing a couple of hits. From coat, can we fix these ones? Is that the one that's fixable? It looks like it. Clay. That's an odd thing to find. Open broken truck. I guess there's no way of fixing this. It's a lot of Z's, man. I might die here. Oh, I might. I'm stuck. Oh, no. I just want to see the rest of town. Don't kill me. Be more like these people. Don't hate, just love. My health's going back up slowly. I think I was a 10 before. Now I'm at 14. All right. Yeah, they give it up. They just have like a aggro range. It just kind of ends really quick. All right. You know what? I got, I got to test it. See if there's anything inside here. We'll get some kind of medical. Got batteries and fiber and weird stuff. Melee level one. Damage. Huh. Seems to be about the same damage to me. They're all making their way back in there. I don't sure. Maybe because of sunlight, they want to get their butts back inside. All right, let's see. Let's do this. I'm gonna go down to Blaze of Glory. I know. Yeah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. All right, well, we, good thing is we actually do respawn back in our bed. A very interesting game, though. I, I actually would like to see more and go through it. I'd like to see where this progresses in the future. And, uh, yeah, maybe go and venture a little bit further out there. It's up to you guys. If you guys want to see more of this, uh, please take time. Hit like button if you're brand new. Please subscribe if you want to pick it up for yourself. Links in the description field. If you want to join in for a chance of winning one of the uh, copies, uh, multiple copies, many copies, uh, the developer sent out. Go ahead, uh, jump in my Discord here. The disc, uh, of course, links in the description down below. This is where the uh, giveaway will be given this week sometime. So thanks for being here. Thanks for being part of this. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge. No catch, guys. Bottom upside.